Hey everybody! Before we get to today's video, let me make a few things uh, out of the way first. So one, I have two bonus videos uh, coming, but uh, you may be wondering, where, where have I been? To be honest, I haven't been as active recently because I've been helping Anthony and I've been just chilling a bit recently. But I want to let you know that Nightwing Dies is still in effect and our Evil Dead uh, movie is still in effect. I think it's going to have a new title too. So here's the progress on that. It is almost done, but I want to sort out these bonus videos that I still had months ago recorded and edited to you guys first. And then we'll hopefully get that out uh, around the end of the year, but time will tell. But uh, I want to let you guys know that very quickly. So these two videos were recorded in August, but it could be uploaded around the end of the year. So right now, we're going to get started with the cut content from Nightmare Lives. Alright everybody, enjoy the video. We'll see you uh, later in the future for no news. Alright, enjoy the video. <laughs> Look to some post-movie content for Nightmare Lives. This is the second... Uh, video I'm doing in that series. Today we're going to be talking about the cut content from Nightmare Labs. These are going to be cut content that will be going from beginning to end and while I'm editing the movie. So with that being said, let's get started. Now you guys may be unaware, but I did early access for D's community. We'll begin with that first and we'll work our way towards there. So let's start with the intro. During the editing of the early access movie, there was no intro at all. As in, no titles for Nightwing Lives. It immediately straight went into the movie. The only 23 presents to the title was cut. But it didn't feel right, so I added it in for early access in the final version of the movie. Some of the early access content is still in there, but in the full movie, so. Now, in the Halloween crossover, one of the songs was cut from that uh, crossover. Originally, I wanted The Way You Make Me Feel by Michael Jackson, but that was cut. Instead, I chose Smooth Criminal, and it works really well. Now, let's move on to the next one, Happy Death Day. There were scenes that were cut from that movie. We had to keep up with the continuity, and it took me a few attempts to do so. So, adding the scenes with Nightwing kept up with the continuity, and it worked really well. So, I'm happy that turned out well. Alright, now we move on to the real meat of the movie, which is the full movie. Now, during the editing, I recorded Jack Frost footage. However, I freaking deleted the footage by accident. I had to remake it, and it turned out really well, so... And I, re and I heard some of you like it, so that's really awesome. That's not a well-known movie, too, so I'm really glad you guys enjoyed it. Now, moving on to another editing issue. The part where I arrive at Spookawa, which is the second half of the movie, unfortunately, it got corrupted and it had to be remade. I cut two songs from the movie. This were Elton John's I Don't Want to Go On With You Like That. And I'm trying to remember the second one. The second one that I believe it would be is... Oh, wait, yeah, now I remember. It was Michael Jackson's Shake Your Body Down to the Ground. That was cut from the movie. Alright. Now let's move on to the next set of crossovers now. We're going to move on to the... Uh, now, Trick or Treat, you probably are familiar with this. That was cut on YouTube because we went into some problems on YouTube where it was blocked. Now... There were one part of the movie that had nudity, so I had to be really careful editing it. But there was no nudity, so it worked out really well. So, and I and I heard you guys really liked it too. Check it out in the uh, check it out. Go to the full movie and check the uh, link in the description below. You'll see the crossover if you haven't seen it yet. But yeah, I really glad you guys enjoyed it. So. Now we move on to Friday the 13th Part 5, the last crossover. We had the same problem as before with Trick or Treat. Now, during the part with Tina, I had to cut one of the scenes. Originally, 
I showed part of the uh, couple, but I can see still kind of a boo. So that was cut and had to be replaced with the guy uh, spying on them. But yeah, we had to be sure this was uh, good for YouTube. So we had to cut that out. And you guys liked it, so. Now, we go to the ending. We talked about this earlier in the last video. If you want to check that out, I will link that in the description below this video. Now, the ending was not supposed to have Ash. This was supposed to have Dr. Loomis in it. I was supposed to be shot around six times and then go back into the portal. But that was scrapped. This was the original plan. But because time really, really changed my mind, we had Ash Rooms instead. And you guys really liked it as well. But yeah, that was the original plan with the ending I had. But, that's it. That's all the cut content from Nightly Lives. I hope this was a learning experience and show you how the editing in the Luby went out. And I hope you guys really like that. That's it for uh, this video. We, I think I got a few more post Luby content I'm gonna do. I know one of them I wanna do. We'll talk about that another time though. But for anyways, that's it for today's video. I'll see you guys next time. Shady Siders, have a good day, good evening, good afternoon, or night. Take care, all.